Hi, welcome to Nova English Academy. Today, we're going to be talking about what's the best teacher for you? Unfortunately, and I wish this wasn't the case, the profession that I love, English teaching, is an industry. This means it's a for-profit business. And many people take advantage of that. Many people open academies and fill them with teachers who are looking to travel. I call them tourist teachers. They're usually quite young, under 30, looking to take a year or two traveling before returning to their home country. They will teach directly out of a book. And if you ask them a question about a grammar point that they're not prepared for, they won't know it. These types of teachers are not necessarily bad, but they're not good either. It's not what they want to do with their lives. They're using your education as a passport to travel the world. So how do you tell if you've got a teacher or a tourist teacher? Well, the simple way to find out is ask them questions. Any decent teacher should be able to answer simple grammar questions without having to look it up in a book. If you ask a teacher to tell you the difference between a gerund and an infinitive, or the difference between the past simple and the present perfect, they should be able to give you a decent explanation without looking in a book first. Because these are basic grammar points that teachers use right the way from A2 through to C2. So if they're teaching, they really should understand these points without having to look up an answer. One of the classic things you will find is when you're in class, grammar connects to all different things. So if you're doing a class on, say, reported speech, that involves knowing all the different tenses in English and how to apply them to that particular grammar point. So for example, if you are using the past simple in reported speech, you would change it to the past perfect simple. Now, you might not understand why we use the past perfect simple. So, of course, you're going to ask your teacher, what's the purpose of the past perfect simple? They've prepared a class on reported speech. So they may not be prepared to stop that class and give you a response to why we use particular tenses. If that happens, you're losing an opportunity to learn. When you ask questions in a class, that's because your brain is trying to make connections. And if your teacher cannot give you those answers like that, that connection opportunity is lost to you. So whenever you're looking for a teacher, always ask them simple questions. If they're a good teacher, they'll be able to give you a good explanation, one that you can understand for your level. The questions I suggest that you ask are, can you tell me the difference between a gerund and an infinitive? And can you tell me the difference between the present perfect simple and the past simple? If they can't give you an answer that you understand, that's not a good teacher. They're probably traveling they're probably looking to visit a country for a year or so, and they're using your education to do that. Find somewhere else. If you have any questions about the kind of knowledge a teacher should have, please feel free to send us an email, drop us a message on WhatsApp, or alternatively call or come into the academy, and we're always happy to answer any questions you may have. Take care.